Second mystery. In order not to overwhelm minds by divine unity, which is apparent in the boundless multiplicity of creatures, the Quran of miraculous exposition constantly points out the manifestation of divine oneness within divine unity. For example, the sun encompasses numberless things with its light. In order to consider the sun itself within the totality of its light, a most extensive conceptual ability and comprehensive view are necessary. So lest the sun itself be forgotten, it is displayed in every shining object by means of its reflection, in accordance with the capacity of each all shining objects display the sun's qualities, such as its light and heat, together with the manifestation of its essence. And just as in accordance with their capacities, all lustrous objects show the sun together with all its attributes. So do the sun's qualities, like its light and heat, and the seven colours in its light, all encompass all the things facing it. In the same way, and Allah's is the highest similitude. But let there be no mistake in the comparison. Just as divine oneness and eternal besoughtedness have a manifestation together with all the divine names in everything, in animate creatures in particular, and especially in man's mirror-like essence, so through divine unity does each of the divine names connected to beings encompass all beings. Thus, lest minds become overwhelmed by divine unity and hearts forget the most pure and holy essence, the Quran constantly puts before the eyes the stamp of divine oneness within divine unity. And it is in the name of Allah, the merciful, the compassionate, that indicates the three important points of the stamp.